Mr. Tan, just now you talked about the president's soft powers, right, to help to enact change in society. So can you maybe elaborate more about that, please? In many countries around the world, they have a king, a queen, or a sultan. These people are referred to as the monarch. And the monarch meets with the prime minister regularly. And the monarch conveys to the prime minister the feelings, the aspirations of the people. If the people are suffering, the monarch tells the prime minister the people are suffering. The monarch's duty uh, is to convey the aspirations and feelings of the people. And that will be the similar role that I will play. I may not be the monarch, but if I'm elected by one million pe people, majority in this election, I will play that role. Uh, and that is the role of the monarch, to convey to the government the feeling and the aspirations of the people. In the elective, you said earlier that you wanted to have conversations with the Prime Minister, with his ministers, with the government. How do you think this will look like? I heard uh, that uh, the Prime Minister meet with the President regularly. I heard that it might be weekly, uh, but it could be once in two weeks. I also heard that the President meet with the ministers uh, regularly. I do not know the exact details, but I do hope that uh, this will be very good arrangements. Uh, if it's not there, I will invite them. Uh, but if it's already there, it will be quite a good arrangement uh, because we're carrying on something that is going on quite well. And I will convey to the Prime Minister and to the ministers the aspirations, the aspirations and feelings of the people. And I want to gather the aspirations and feelings through a separate channel uh, so that the Prime Minister can gather through his current channel, uh, but I will gather through another channel so we can compare our notes. That, would, that is what I intend to do.